Hey guys, this is East for the Eastern Cat in Zanel. Welcome back to Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke. So uh, we're in the building that's heading down from Eterna City because we're pretty much done with this whole city. And I just talked to this guy because he was one of those scientist looking people you see in these buildings right the time. And we got the EXP share! So uh, I think there's probably a limitation on it that you needed to have at least seen this number of Pokemon. But apparently I've seen 131. Thank you, Randomizer. But um... Which, be, which is actually pretty good, because I actually have the EXP share now, if I ever get my team messed up a bit, I can quickly train something up by sending them in the back. But uh, anyways, we're going to be going down Bicycle Road, I believe? Yeah. So we need, yeah, Cycling Road. So we need to get on our bike, which I don't have uh, registered, because I'm highly intelligent and registered by map instead. I should probably register a bike. Alright, how do you use this game? It's pretty slow. Actually, wait, no, this has a slope, doesn't it? You know, I can't actually ride a bike in real life. As embarrassing as that may be, I never needed to ride a bike. So... Wait, do I have a brake on this? I don't know if I got a brake on this, I'm just sliding! Oh god! Alright, I'm just gonna see if I can work out the controls of this thing once I'm done with this guy. Cause this is gonna be awkward if I fly a uh, mighty Anna. Um... Let's see, Machiena can take down and bite and not much else. Cut. Kinda worked. Oh, oh. Alright, it's gonna be one of those those people again. Can we um astonish? I miss. That doesn't it wait. It's a normal type. Alright, we need a fighting attack. It's just gonna sand attack my face off, so we may as well just punch it before it keeps going. Alright, Mac Punch! Mark Punch! Please don't sand attack me. Ah, oh, you bitch. Alright, punch it. Take that. Wait. So it's a ghost type that secondary type protects it from fighting. That has to be yeah, because oh no wait, no no no. It's a normal type that secondary type protects it from fighting. Because it's Yeah, that should be yeah. I have no idea what the second type is, except that um it's strong to fighting, which is sidekick or flying. I don't have much good choices, so I'm just gonna keep trying to punch you. And I'm probably gonna miss because this bitch is sand attacking me like a crazy asshole. Okay, bit me. Never mind. Keep doing that so I can actually kill you. I am fine with this. Keep doing this. Take this. I was identified. I still don't know what that means. Alright, if I miss this next hit, I'm gonna rage a bit. Alright, suck it. And get the hell out of here. Alright, so now I'm gonna work out how to use my brake. So I'm pretty sure this bike has a brake. If your bike doesn't have a brake, I would suggest um, probably adding one. It's not safe to ride your bike without a brake. Alright. Uh, brake. No, that's a, that's a gear. That's not... That, nope. That, that's a pause button. That's it. That's it. Do I not have a brake? Really? Do I just not use these people as brakes? That is crazy. What was this button? Nope, not this one either. Not this one either. Alright, we don't have a brake. We have a gear though. Actually, if I cha keep changing gears, can- Wait, this feels like the Mac bike. That's regular. That's Mac. Okay, so we don't have a brake, which is gonna be hilarious. Alright, you. I need to cut over to you. I swear, there was a brake on the bike, wasn't there? There's been a brake on the bike for like the past... Actually, no. I can't remember there's a brake on the bike in the past game. I know there was one, like, an original one, so they could slow down. You know, I don't know if they added that in Leaf Green and Fire, or they had that route. Why is this thing on Sandstorm? Um... But anyways, uh, okay, so... Cut. We should be safe, this thing's an HP... Actually no, I might kill myself because of the counter. Uh, 
That should be fine. That should be fine. Cut. I should probably try Astonish as well. And I'm a steel monkey, so I don't get hit by sandstorm. Suck on it. Alright, that's no better. Yeah, keep Miracoating. You totally don't need to counter it. Just keep Miracoating. Everything will be fine. Yes, keep doing that. Just keep doing that. And go to hell. Alright, that's two people down. I can't remember how long Cycling Road actually is in this game. I mean, the first time Cycling Road appeared, it was long as hell. You know there wasn't actually much trainers once you go down like halfway. But, alright, let's have a look. Okay, where's the guy here? Yoink. I should probably just let myself drop. There's not really much point in me, like, actually trying to work out if there's anyone coming. If I see someone, I pass them without fighting them, that's just like, turn around and go back up. Which is actually also a pain here, so it's going up as a pain. Kakuna! That can't poison Sting because it's just been randomized to Kakuna and not a evolved Kakuna. Cut! She. I might need to switch out. Ah, that's fine. I don't think it'll harden itself to infinity. Alright, we're just gonna Fury Swipes. There's no that all these spikers have like one Pokemon, they're like 21. Which is great, because that's a decent amount of EXP, one's an effect, one's a Wino, one's a Kakuna, that does actually nothing. I actually don't know if I should just use high the base damage or cut or just try to fury swipe it down. Ah, uh, let's just waste our fury swipes, we don't need them. Oh yeah, I don't know if I mentioned this, but um We switched uh Bong out for Don't Make Me Go Eight. Cause I remembered you need to cut down the bottom of the um cycling road, so we don't have our owl. Which I don't think will hurt us in the long run because we already have a steel electric type. And our um combi. Our Zerg Queen. That's still not become a queen, it's still just a Zerg. Just, just still a Ling. You can still participate in Ling rushes so that you can try and cheese people out. I've never actually played StarCraft myself, I just watch it. 20! Still no new moves. I don't think I've had a new move on anything in a long time. Alright. Let us lie. Okay, you, you. Oh, Jesus, no. Oh, there's berries down there. And a hiker. Oh, free Pokemon. That's a change. Oh, as long as you're not a steel type, I don't care. Take this. Oh, God, it's tank. It's so tank. That thing can't magnitude, right? A lot of weird things hit magnitude, so it's kind of worrying. Try again. Actually, I should probably send attack here. I don't want like a max power and roll up and hit me in the face. Alright, good sir. I need you to miss. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it! Uh, this right must have like sealed before the last hit or something. Stupid like that. Come on, miss! Stop rolling on my face! And again. I don't even know if I can eat a full hit like this. Um, energy powder! Heal! Heal! Don't kill me, please. I know I just got my easy shake close to the battle, but I don't want to die in one shot from this. There we go, I finally missed on the last hit. Alright, so that should be safe for now. Yeah, stay right there and keep rolling around like a moron. Oh, I can bite? Wait, this thing can bite? I will admit that I have not really touched fossil Pokemon since I played um, red and blue and yellow, I was one of those kids. But honestly, I didn't get very far in those games because those were quite a bit more difficult than they are nowadays. Mainly the fact that you, it's a bit of a pain in the ass to try and train anything. 
so you don't just use the same things over and over again. Sway nub. Uh, Sway nub. I still don't know if it's got ground moves. And three of my things are weak to ground moves. That's not good. I let's just punch her in the face and be done with it. Punch her in the face. Ah, you bitch. I don't want to shot you anyway. Now don't do that again. And there's a swine up down. I still don't know what I can do. I don't enjoy it. Sudo Wudu. Rock Throw and Low Kick. That's the only moves I have a Sudo Wudu to actually know about. And you're the only one that can fight it. My team sucks against fighting types. Um, probably not rock. Let's try dark. Pursue. Regular damage. Okay. How about we just do a good old punch in the face then? Rock smash. Regular damage. Defense down. Oh, it's flailing like an idiot. Actually, that kind of hurt. Quick attack. Should be able to kill it, right? Third resist. Okay, there we go. If it wasn't rock or steel, because I wouldn't know, because, um... My fighting would be super effective, so... Uh, quick attack had that worked, I think. Alright, slide! Hey, bro. And next guy. A Munchlax. I still have no idea what that typing that Snorlax was, so I have no idea what typing you are either. But cut. I should have switch something else to the front. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Amnesia. Because forgetting things makes you resist people blowing fire or water on you better. So kids, if you ever find yourself in a giant fire, just forget everything. Actually, that's a terrible idea. That's probably why I'm not a teacher. Alright, that's a Munchlax, a Skitty. Actually, does anyone need Libbles? You need Libbles, you need to evolve, damn it. I don't believe a Skitty poses any threat, especially when the second thing was a Munchlax. But usually, I'm pretty sure Skitty's main threat is, um... Was it a Snoss? Is this this? The one where the cat puts on flying around just uses to attack from its own team. I should know this, my sister was really intent on catching a skinny that one time. You know the end of that story was we ended up catching it way off away from its um was it swarm time, so we had to like sit there for that one percent. Inside the stupid forest, my stuff was severely overleveled and why did I just get flame bodied? I kinda want a skitty now. It's got a flame body. The kitty is on fire. Alright. So anyways. Uh, down- Hey! Sup, I just crashed into you. There's a Pokemon down there. I want it. And another one Pokemoner. Wigglytuff! If it can kill me, it'll be rollout. I know that for a fact. I'm running out of- oh, Well, I'm not running out, but halfway through my cuts. Cut! Got that HP tank. Oh! Alright, we're not running out of cuts because we can't use it anymore. Fury Swipe! And again! And again! And again! And... God damn it. Just let me have the fight hit hit man, this thing's gonna take forever to kill, it's got so much health. One! And a two! And... That was disappointing. You know what? Will you die from this? Regular damage. But please flinch. God damn it. Alright, fine, we'll keep doing this. It will die one day. 
Come on. Got it. Got it. Alright. And I... Is that the last guy? I can't tell. I feels like I'm getting to the bottom of this. There's like... Nope, there's still two more people. And you're running out of attacks. You're burnt. Do I have a... Uh, I got raw berries. Um... Do I have burn heals actually? Of course not. Why did I carry a burn heal to still in the game? Maybe I should because of this freaking nuzzle. Uh, randomizer. Uh, I got one raw berry. I ain't good. Um, alright, so... <laughs> actually no, do I have seal powder? Of course not. Um... <laughs> Alright, well screw me. So, I should've bought some heal powder while I was in the previous town, but we're just gonna throw you out there. If you need a potion, we'll give you a potion. Actually you no. Know, at this point, we'll just give you Orange Berry. Luckily, I've been planting these and just like, kinda dealing with them between recordings, but... Anyway, so let's continue sliding down. Actually, I wonder if I should just EXP share my, um, the Queen at this point. Just try and make it evolve, just force it a bit. Rapidash! It's probably gonna kick my ass a bit. I can stomp and I can flame wheel. I'm poison type, so I can't really do much about that. I have no idea what typing you are, but take that. Hey, that worked. That works very well. Eh, come on. EXP! EXP! Yeah, EXP! Acrobat. In my memory, all I can do is dark and flying attacks. Um, you should last. Oh, yeah, well, I'll just switch out, you know. Actually, you can this thing pursue? I don't think it can. This is usually weak against it. It's still weak against it, goddammit. I'll piss off. Alright, um, Ember. Ow. I'm confused. I smacked myself in lay face. Because that's apparently what you do when you're confused. Yeah, has sent X. It doesn't work because I'm normal type. Alright, now slam in the face, don't flinch. God damn it. Slam in the face. Slam in the face. A bad. And you got paralyzed, you bitch. Alright, fighting wasn't effective, but I had no idea what typing it is apart from like either flying or psychic. And it's not weak to water either. What the hell is this thing? It has to be a dual typing, right? Cause um... Nothing that resists fighting and resists water as well. Great leader 21! Wants to learn Flame Wheel! Yes sir! We'll just take out the Ember because your special attack is terrible! And flame wheel. Perfect though. And Santa's X is nearly 23. Alright, where are we sliding to? Alright, we need to get that guy as well, so we'll just um not have you in the front, but you're kinda of dying. And we'll put out our steel monkey one more time. Crash into this person. I like how they don't the trainer doesn't actually like notice you do you fly into them with the facing up. You just like literally crash into them and he's like, hey, fight me! You just kind of ram straight into me and dust more. Um, but fight me. Alright, so this is usually a ghost type. I don't think it becomes a ghost dark. So shit. Either way, it probably only knows ghost and dark attacks. And maybe it's like a attack, but that all should not work against the steel monkey. They identified me. Why does the ghost type need to identify when they're the ones that get identified? And cut! 
Oh great! Well, I can't complain about that one, that's called a 100 percent hit. But you're still a bitch. Alright, keep going, keep trying. Don't hit yourself. You hit yourself, god damn it. That hurt. That really hurt. Hey, snap the confusion off of one turn! You can't flinch me, I move faster than you! Take it and go! Take it and go! Hey, crit me, that's not fair! Kill him! Oh, you bitch! Alright, fine, Furious White. I'm like, my cuts are like red, it's like fully running out. Alright, bitch, dropped in. We can learn Swift, but my my special attack is terrible. So why would I bother? It would be a really nice move, but wasn't for the fact the special attack was so low. Cause that'll deal with all my sand attack and double team problems I've been having. But anyways, we're through. Where's the door? Oh, it's soft lighting. No. Hey, who are you? Wait, why should give us a flag? Because we're riding a bike? Oh, anyways, we're through Cycling Road, and now we want to go under Cycling Road. It's a raspberry! I actually kind of want to get off my bike. Um, I should really- I screw, I just register it. Why am I registering my map? I know I use it a lot, but if I send it to the top of my thing, it's fine. Register this. And we can just click Y and get off my bike! Yay! Alright, so uh, we're just gonna go drop down to our bow first to um, heal up. The berries are, the berries are like fully dead. Um, <laughs> Alright, so let's go down here and just go to our bow real quick and then we'll go back up through underneath Cycling Road. We catch something there, so that's gonna be a bit of fun. Heal me, please. Get that burn off my Zerg. We didn't even run into a... What's that flame spitting one called? The Viking? No. I have no idea what that unit's called. Uh, but anyways, we need to go back up. I think we need to switch out the... Uh, our bike. Change gear so that we're going fast. And we get off the bike. Great! Alright, so where do we cut? Right over here. Alright, we're allowed to catch something here because it's Route 206. It's the only part of the game which is Route 206. Um... Oh, that's glitchy! Alright, nope. Save. Quick, save. Before anything goes wrong, save. Oh god, saving a lot of data. Oh, please don't crash, please don't crash. Save, quick, go, save. Oh, come on. What do you have to say? I didn't do that much. I can change one move on one Pokemon. Oh, it's no glitchy as hell. Oh, oh god. Wait, is that showing up the recording? Oh god, it's showing up the recording. Oh god. Alright, Church Bell. I don't know what that does. What does Church Bell do? Um, this way. Not this way? Where was it? Where is it? A, a church bull. Okay, so that's similar to... Actually, I don't know what that's similar to. But, here's a hiker. Hi, bro. There are two caves. Because one's like right underneath Cycling Road somewhere. It wasn't like here, was it? Ow. I just ran into something. Uh, but anyways, here is our Rawsberries. Fantastic. Is that one Rawsberry? I need two! I kinda really need more raw berries. I should probably plant some outside Orbo. Probably should have planted them when I passed that bit of earth. I'm definitely not going back underneath here. Uh, where the hell am I? Pokeball! Go Pokeball! Repeat ball! Well, I won't complain about free balls, but that's not gonna help me. Um, here's another high case. This guy probably wants to fight me. <laughs> hey, bro!
Hi, Kev Theodore. As Electrovire. You can definitely use electric attacks. So I'm getting the hell out of here. Uh, do I have anything I can take away? No, I don't. Alright, so we're gonna hit it and kill it and do it fast. Ow. Oh, come on! I just pop out and crits me and paralyze me in the first hit. Well, screw you too, bro. Oh, God damn it! Luckily, I'm pretty sure Elixir Buzz's line evolution is actually higher on physical. Punch it! Punch it! The higher on physical damage, so the Thundershock should not be killing me super fast. And if only I had Lyra Thundershock, it can't kill me that fast because the thing's dropping does not help its Thundershock. Wait. Alright, so it's dual type. One of them is either Rock or Steel, the other is strong to fighting. Now, I'm not gonna risk it being steel and just try to hit it with something else, so I'm just gonna hit it with Rock Smash again. Hit it! Hit it! <sighs> Alright. We can still do this. Hit it! Hit it! Fantastic! Alright, next guy. A bay leaf. Um, so we did fight one of these. Uh, cause Chuck. Someone had a Chocorita. The Galactic Min Leader had a Chocorita. A Chocorita. I'm chewing on my words. I don't remember why I did to it. I did that to the ages to kill it. Cause it just keeps synthesizing me. But, bug bite. Doesn't work. Okay, um, Gust. Works, but doesn't do shit. And it's already synthesizing. Well, you're a bitch. Alright, so Buckman didn't work, Gust did. Huh. Oh, what could that be? That should be a dual type, right? I don't... Does it even resist bug that's weak to flying? It's like a really weird combo and you're getting really dark. I need to turn on my lights. Alright, my chain's gonna probably fart a little bit. Okay, I can see again. Uh, let's try a flame wheel. That didn't really work. Um, I don't know. Punch it. Punch it. Regular damage. Ah, oh my God! I do. I don't have any strong flying attacks. And I really can't work out what type it is. Unless it has to be a dual type. I. Would it be fire fighting maybe actually? Let me try that. That sounds like a feasible combination with buggers weak and fighting strong. Eat water gun. Wrong guess! Alright, fine, we'll do it this way. Ice ball! No matter how many synthesize, I'll eventually one-shot you, probably. Or get close enough that I can probably just body slam you. Ice Ball. Actually no, shouldn't be running out of synthesize already? It's really like the third one, isn't it? Third or fourth one? Oh. <sighs> Alright, tank it up. And beat it down. And I missed. Fuck my life. Alright, so we're just gonna slam in the face with Body Slam and hope I kill it. Because I'm kinda pissed. Take that. The least paralyzing. Well, that worked pretty well. And it reflected the game. God damn it. Alright. I know I'm getting hurt by poison. Do that again. Oh my god, that freaking reflip.
Ah, the poison! Slam it! Paralyze it! Please! Actually, I think that was the last uh, synthesize. Don't kill me, poison! I like taking 10 health off at a time. Holy shit. Alright, be leaf down. Good. So I'm pretty sure uh, in this game, poison wears off. I don't know if I should risk that, though. <laughs> So I kinda want to keep Santa 6. It's kind of important. And Zero Queen Dammit, please evolve. Yes! Zero Queen has evolved! Our Ling is transmuting into a queen! Yeah! We have our Queen B! Power Gym! And I can't remember when it, when it learns the rest of its moves. But we need an antidote. You need an antidote. Uh, we'll leave the paralysis. Oh, great. Okay. Let me just get. Okay, uh, we we'll guess we're catching something. Houndoom! What's the best way to hit you? Is the next question. Um, you can probably burn me to the ground, but let's just try a cut. Don't roar. Please do not roar at me. As long as this thing does not have roar, I think I will be fine. We'll try and throw some Pokeballs at it. One, and a two, and a three. Hey, yeah, catching Pokemon has been a lot more gentle to me ever since I started raging on my like, first five or something. And the question is, what do we call this thing? The flames are breached when angry contain toxins. Why? You know, that sounds incredibly dangerous. If it burns you while it's pissed off, that's gonna hurt forever. Um, so, what can we call this thing? I don't have a good name for this. Um, and I don't play any other games that have dogs in them, which is kind of hard. Huh. Actually, I don't even know why I use this thing. Um, And you know what, you can be Mr. Sh I don't know if you use S or Style, but I think Style sounds better than S. As an ESS. But, alright, welcome to the team. Alright, let me just get out of this grass, please. Alright, we're out of the grass. And we're on the still on the cycling road. Let's see something over here. Alright, we'll go get that next time. I think we'll finish off here. It's been going for a little bit. I've got one thing kind of dying, one thing paralyzed. We still got an egg and we have a beautiful Zerg Queen now. So, um, anyways, uh, we're gonna go through the two different caves in this undercycling road. I can't remember where to find them, I might have to look it up. But I do know one is right at the back and I think one is actually visible, so... Uh, anyways, that'll be it for Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke for this time. If you want to follow along, remember to subscribe. Thanks for watching and until next time.